Hey everybody, welcome back. Um, I don't know who to talk to. Which one of these guys looks the most tough? I guess the cat, probably. Oh, she looks feisty. Oh, that mangy looking thing? Damn, dude. Let's not be racial, Larry. Oh, you're telling me? It's about time we get someone with nine lives to help us out. <laughs> I wouldn't mind accidentally wasting her a few. Ew. Lady. Can I help you, boys? I, uh, to be totally honest with you, the rest of the game could consist of nothing but, like, making fun of, like, like, the weird, like, meta-racist commentary that they're going on here, and I would laugh at every single line. Uh, let's see. How long have you been here? How long have you been here? About a month. I'm sick and tired of vagabonding, so I'm sticking to this place for a while. So listen. We are professional scavenger guides, and we would like to give you an opportunity to work with us. Scavenge? That's more of a dog business. Why do you have to go out of your way to offend me? <laughs> I'm standing here being more than polite. Don't play naive. You've been giving me this dirty dog look this whole time. Well, that's because you've been giving me your insulting oh, cat God. look. Oh, God. What this... looks? Are you too crazy? Just get him a leash. He's a menace to society. Oh, God. There is no society, you dumb mouser. Ooh. How dare you? Ugh. Look, I don't care about it. She got her claws so, out now. Scavenge? Okay. Do you want to trade? I don't trade. But I do gamble. Interested? Is it a game of dice? Of course. But first, you have to tie that dog to a tree. I don't trust him. So a question from chat is... That's a she. Did, did you expect to see, like, a pair of boobs on her? Like, why is it so surprising? Like, it's a little hard to tell from just looking at a cat wearing clothes if it's gonna be, a, like, a like a dude cat or a, or a chick cat. Like... <laughs> Alright, uh... I am not taking this anymore! I am not taking this anymore. How the hell do I guess oh, yeah. it every time? One black eye is not enough for you, puppy. Just fucking stop it. I'm warning you. Down, doggy. Sit. Play dead. Uh. Grr, that's it. Get up. I'm kicking your ass. Uh, that's it. Get up. I'm kicking your ass. I'd like to see you try. Bring it on. Is there going to be a fighting minigame now? Filthy mutt. Would you look at that? What? I was drawn by Hello? the far side cartoon have a guy. Fight here. Big deal. This is our third today. Uh, what's a deal? So what's her deal? I don't know. She likes to fight, I guess. What the hell? <laughs> God. He's got both black eyes now. I got an achievement for that. Ozzy Osbourne look. Wow. That's a, uh, timely reference. Ozzy Osbourne has been relevant in, like, 15 years, but we'll bring him back. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we can get through this. <sighs> Between recording sessions, I realized that I'm a little bit more sloshed than I expected because I bought beer that is way, way higher alcohol percentage than I thought it was going to be. So, I've had two... I'm basically at four beers deep. That was a mistake. Here we go. Oh, God. <clears throat> what kind of cat are you? What kind of a cat are you? The one you don't want to mess with. You're insane. You have, like, meth head strength or something. Ooh. Oh, this shit. So, you're still up for some gambling? Uh, maybe later. I want to check on Larry first. Maybe later. I want to check on Larry first. All right. Don't forget to come back. I'm not really interested in doing the gambling mechanic in this game. Getting your ass kicked by a girl, huh? You getting your ass kicked by a girl, huh? So what if she's a girl? She's a cat. How is that helping your case? Well, yeah, I guess it doesn't. Okay, I guess I can take control back. What's the percentage on the beer? It is 9%. Ah, ha, 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 ha. All right, I guess we'll talk to the guy who looks like he's a fisherman. 
I want to try convincing this one. Oh, Suit yeah, yourself. right. Hey there, fellow. How are fellow? Whatever you're selling, I ain't buying. <laughs> Immediately lead with the racial stuff. Okay, let's go for it. I'm. It's. It would be funnier to me to read with like the racial stuff in this game. I know it's not gonna work well, but I'm very, very tempted. All right, let's go for it. Uh, I promise it's better than eating flies here in this camp. I promise it's better than eating flies here in this camp. There's nothing better than eating flies here. Suit yourself. So, what do you want? How would you like to join us in scavenging? What part did you not understand? <laughs> uh, oh. True, though. True, though. Sorry. He's a dumbass. Can't really focus. Uh, sorry, uh, he has ADHD. Can't really focus. I'm allowed How to say that. How do you feel about that? trading? Hmm, trading's good. Show me what you got. I know. That's why I said it. Alright, so we got... Some stuff we can trade for. Fishing pole might be pretty good. Carrots are definitely pretty good. Yeah, we'll, we'll trade the uh, toilet paper for two carrots. Those are an obvious trade up there. Box and nails, that's a total wash. We don't really need that. Monopoly, nah, that's not particularly useful. Medium first aid kit's pretty good. Can of tuna is great. We could sell, let's see, let's see. We definitely want to pick up the tuna. Um, if I sell the box of cigs, I can pick up some tuna. I can pick up two things of tuna. Those are, that's excellent. I can pick up, I have seven pence left. Picking up the medium first aid kit would be pretty good, but I don't know. I don't know about the rest of the stuff. We'll hang on to most of this. The liqueur is actually not particularly great with regards to uh, the guild value. At best, it might be like a plus three. So I'm probably going to want to... Oh, yeah, yeah. I could definitely get rid of the dry red wine. The other value is 18 versus guild of five to 15. So this is much better to trade to him. Now what do I want, though? So, we're probably going to want to pick up the... We definitely don't care about the Monopoly. Oh, yeah, yeah, we're working towards picking up the first aid kit. Oh, okay, that's excellent. Yeah, yeah, this is great. Um, So, we have a profit of five on our end. So, we can pick up... I guess the box of nails is just a like, lateral trade, so I might as well pick that up. That's pretty inert. And then, yeah, that's pretty good. We have a fair amount of, gid, uh, of guild value going for us with this stuff, so that's pretty good. Uh, I may, I'm definitely considering getting rid of the liqueur, because that's not particularly great. What can I pick, uh, if, I, if I pick up the liqueur, or if I drop the liqueur off. Okay, we'll keep the liqueur, uh, oh no, no. We'll trade back the vodka. Which one did I get rid of? Oh, I think I must have clicked on the vodka instead of the liqueur. Okay, this guy doesn't really have anything else I care about. Good stuff. Very good. See you around. Good trading. That definitely uh, worked out very much in my advantage. Wait, Hank. What? Are we really going to ask a freaking wombat? Why not? I mean, I mean, just look at him. So much yeah, racism. Yeah, I know what you mean. But what's the harm? Let's just talk with him. Ah, uh, all right. Hey there, little guy. How was... You want to be friends? Oh, my God. <laughs> um, yeah, sure. Um, uh, yeah, sure. And how do you feel about scavenging with friends? You see, we have this deal that we offer to only some... I'll do it. Wait, what? I'll do it. Let's go scavenging. Oh my okay. god, this guy's the stupidest voice. Uh, why is everyone Australian? That's a really good question. Um, I feel like half the characters I've encountered so far have been Australian. 
Half of them have been from Jersey. And I think it's literally just like they went onto like voiceacting.com and they were like, like, all right, you do a stereotype. You'd be like, a, uh, 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 and then you'd be like, a, like, a, uh, and you'd be like, a, uh, 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 and then that's how they did all of their roles. So say if the bird, one of us scavenges and the, the other ones are the lookouts. One of us scavenges and the other ones are the lookouts. What do I get to do? You, my friend, get to do the... The fun part. The fun part. Scavenging? Uh, you got it, buddy. Yay! Oh. Oh, we're okay. terrible. Uh, good, then. And we'll let you keep... Uh, this guy's really, really dumb. I bet I can definitely go for 20% of the loot and we'll go for it. 20% of the loot. 20% of the loot? I get to keep all of that? Yep. Yeah, sure. Whoa! Sign me up! Welcome aboard. Hank, just a moment. What the actual fuck is going on here? <laughs> I've just made a sweet deal. Yeah, you have. Nothing about this seems off to you? Relax, it's all under control. Okay, buddy, let's go. Oh. Bumba Wombat. What? What? Uh, <laughs> dude, he's a wombat. Womba bomb whatever. <laughs> That's what they yell when they have. <laughs> oh my god, that's amazing. Let's go. Let's go. Where to? There's only one nearby place. A bookstore. Holy shit, that's so funny. Womba womba wombat. I can go inside. It's gonna be yep. caught him. Oh boy, you know. look at all these books. I hope they have lots of pictures. <laughs> all right, so obviously Larry is uh is is doing some um foreshadowing here, and that I think that this guy's gonna it's like some sort of setup, and he's trying to betray us. He's probably just pretending to be stupid. So he's like, "Oh boy, twenty percent," and then later on he's gonna like pull out a gun or like the raccoon's gonna come back and they're gonna be friends or whatever, and he's like. Like, I'm, I, I got my friend with the gun here. He gonna shoot you 20% of the time. Yeah. Uh, you like art? You like art? Yes, yes. Art pictures. Just leave him be, Larry. Okay, this guy's definitely fun. playing dumb. Looting, yay! Oh, whoa! Yes. All of these are worth an incredible amount of money. Wow. Uh, there's definitely going to be some um, trick to this shit. Somewhere this is not going to play out super well. I guess we'll go with history of medicine and mammal anatomy. Those are probably the most valuable. Beyond that, maybe want to pick up car engineering, electric... Oh, I guess I should pick up all of them. I'm just doing the looting Here phase. More. <laughs> Whatever. Are there any medicine books? Those are worth the most in the guild. I don't know. Well, what books did you pick up? Um... No pictures on these. Picture... Pictures? Wait, you mean you can't read? Will you stop it, Larry? Wamba Bumba Wombat. Again with that? <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> What's the matter with you, Larry? How are you just ignoring all this? Who cares? We all have our personality <laughs> Friends, I heard something. Uh-oh. Somebody is inside this locker. Somebody probably locked themselves in there before turning into a... <laughs> Weirdo. Weirdo. I'll let him out. Uh, no, 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 no. Weirdo means a bad animal. Uh, the, the ones that bite and look ugly. But what if he's my friend? No, Wombie, just leave it there. Friend, are you a weirdo? Uh, would you give us a second, Wombat? Wait, Hank, is he... is he retarded? Hey, whoa! <laughs> That's And you knew about this? What? No, of, of course not. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> We're using a mentally disabled animal to scavenge for us. Really weird thing is how you didn't notice. Hey, don't change the subject here, you fucking psycho. Like, this is a lot about you. <laughs> Hank, we have a... Ri Challenged animal <laughs> that is about to release a zombie so they can become friends. 
Maybe it's not a zombie. Well, actually, that could be true. No, I'm just kidding. Of course it's a zombie. What kind of animal would lock itself in the closet for no reason? Hey, give me the binoculars. Yes, uh, I think this locker can't be locked from the inside. So? So somebody locked this animal in the locker. Because it was about to turn into a zombie. Uh, just listen to the sounds it's making. Look, we already confused a drunk parrot for a <laughs> zombie. Maybe its mouth is taped shut. Hank, if we leave it here, we might be condemning oh an animal God. to its death. And if we open it, we might be condemning a wombat to his death. Uh... Not if we're careful. Wombi, listen. You have the lockpicking tool I gave you. I'll guide you into unlocking the locker, and then just run away before anything gets out. Yes. No, 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 it's too dangerous. Oh, no. I mean, it's like a 99% chance that it's actually just a weirdo in there. There's no way that that's not a zombie. Uh, that being said, every single scenario I've been fairly risk averse. So maybe this is the uh, maybe this is the time to like let it out. Oh god, this wombat's so fucked. He's so screwed. All right, let's go. Just do it, but first pick up that pipe from the floor in case it's not a friend. Okay. Now let me guide you in unlocking this. Oh god, this is gonna end poorly. the tension. Ah, shit. Ah, shit. There we go. What is the purpose of lockpicking minigames in any game at all, honestly? They're all these... Every lockpicking minigame is terrible. This one is not an exception, by the way. This is one of the crappier lockpicking minigames I've ever played. Uh, oh, my God. Am I not surprised? Yes. What the hell are you doing in that locker, you idiot? Carl... Uh oh, he's making zombie noises. Shit. Hank, look at him. He might actually be a zombie at this point. Eh, he always looks like that. No, he's not talking. And look at his eyes. Son of a bitch. I don't know. We've got to tell the wombat what to do. Okay, wombie. Uh, he's probably a friend. I hope to God he's a friend. Stay cool. He's a friend. Okay. Oh man, I don't know if this is such a good idea. What's the worst that can happen? Uh, the wombat dies? I meant to us. Maybe we should tell him to kill making it. a lot of zombie noises. I don't know. Oh god. Oh god, I don't know what to do. Oh, it's Carl. I feel like this is all like leading up to a punchline where he's not actually a zombie. I mean, it is just Carl. It is just Carl. Oh, God. And I don't want the bulls to get pissed off at me. We're going to go with, nah, it's just Carl. It's cool. Nah, it's just Carl. It's cool. Hi, friend. I'm not your friend. Yes. What? I'm not your friend. <laughs> Bitch. Don't you. He's just drunk. What kind of drunk is that? Wait, who is that? It's Hank. You idiots again! What the <laughs> fuck are you doing locked in a closet? I'm not in the closet. Oh, jeez. You were a moment ago. I was? What? Oh, yeah. I was. I think it was the fucking bulls. Yes, they locked me in. What assholes? <laughs> <laughs> fucking bulls. <laughs> <laughs> They didn't know. This is that such I a great game. On me. So the jokes on them. The jokes. <laughs> I don't think that makes the joke. Like, look, whatever. Look, the truck. The bulls truck. Yes. Listen, wombat. You can't tell the bulls you're with us. I, just pretend you're here on your own. But we are friends. Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, but let's play a game where we're not. But let's play a game where we're not. No, <laughs> we are friends. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Hey, what is this? Did you let Zombie Carl out? Hello, friends. He is way too drunk. He could have stumbled into a zombie like that while we were away. Ah, I wouldn't worry about that. 
I'm positive the zombies already accepted him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is true. Wait. Ah, oh, God, it? Hank, Oops. you're such a dumbass. Is that you? And here I was, worried the mentally disabled wombat would blow our cover. <laughs> Dog, you sons of bitches. We've been wandering aimlessly a whole day without our map. I didn't come into your apartment to rob you. You racist bastards deserve it. <laughs> Where are you anyway? Um. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I don't know which one to go with. Both are equally hilarious. At our secret base. At our secret base. You'll never find us. I'm sure this wombat won't mind taking a beating for you then. What do you want? Our map. Well, you can't have it. Come here. Do you want to be friends? Oh what no. Another joker like you, Rabbit? They are very similar. <laughs> Not a deal, anyhow. What do you care? Oh, nothing. We were just... Curious. Curious. Curiosity is a dangerous thing these days, Rabbit. You picked up that line from a Schwarzenegger movie. <laughs> what? No, I didn't. Uh, stick around. What are you talking about? I thought we were doing Schwarzenegger quotes. So, what's it gonna be? Are we need is to that misspelled? A or what? All right, listen. I've seen the guild's item values on your map. It appears the big items are worth a lot. Stop taking an interest in our guild. So you guys are looking for big stuff, right? Like my fancy stove? What do you care what we're looking for? Because I saw... Uh, ooh, probably the an appliance store is what I would go with. Schwarzenegger. Yeah, they definitely misspelled Schwarzenegger. And again, this also implies that Arnold Schwarzenegger exists in this reality. Which is something I don't want to think about. Because what, uh, what animal could he possibly be? Does Germany even have animals? That's doubly funny because he's from Austria. An appliance store that has not been looted at all. An appliance store that has not been looted at all. Not even windows are broken. Whatever. So I can tell you exactly where it is. If you let the wombat and most importantly, his loot go. I don't trust you, rabbit. We gotta trust each other. We'll be under the same roof soon. So you are looking to join over my dead body. And let's not be rash here. I'm beating up the wombat. Because we're friends? Shut up, you joker. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, these people are very progressive. Wait, the wombat is intellectually disabled. Wait, I, the wombat is uh, intellectually disabled. Yeah, right. Hold on, Barney. He might be. Look at him. Seriously? Hi, friend. He's pretending. I'm not so sure. Let's just take all of his loot and leave him be. Earl, what does he have? Uh, hold on, hold on. Listen, we won't join the guild if you leave his loot. Why should we trust you? Uh, we like traveling. We don't care about joining some stupid guild. We like traveling. We don't care about joining some stupid guild. Hmm, is that so? Yes, we were just teasing you. Hmm. All right, but if we see you there, I'll consider our agreement to be broken, and I oh, will not sucks. take it lightly. Sure, we promise. Oh God. Okay. Scram That's gonna come back to then. haunt me. me. Yes. Me what? Get out of here. Here? Just get out of here, you weirdo. Go. I hate it when they misuse that word. Bye -bye, <laughs> weirdo. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Well done, wombat. Can we have our part of the loot? Yes. Oh boy, this is gonna be awesome. <laughs> Look at all that. I'm gonna get a million books. I think I played that one right. Alright, what are the best books? Probably... Alright, so we got one that are 10 to 50, so we'll take that one. That's 10 to 50 as well. Uh, oh, I misclicked. Okay, so we got those two that are 10 to 50. Then we need the 10 to 30 ones. So, car engineering, uh, weather prediction guide. After that, it looks like it's the 5 to 30. I like how this is kind of like this war of mine, but like a really fucking stupid version of it. Where it's like there are deep morality choices, and all of them are terrible. See you around, Wombie. Can I come with you? Oh, um... 
Well, you know. Uh, you can find a way better group than us. Uh, you can find a way better group than us. You're way out of our league. You're right. Right. Uh, we gotta go. Uh, see you around, Wombie. Oh, okay. I'm not even gonna take him back to the park. I feel bad. Aw. Aww. I'm feeling really bad about this, Hank. Don't worry about it. I bet you two lines of code that he'll survive longer than we do. Hmm. Sure. <laughs> I would actually take him up on that bet, too.